Okay, so here we go. So I'm going to be sending you guys uh, some memory. It's a 2 gig chip. So what you do with a laptop, take it, flip it over gently. Uh, there's a little latch right here uh, to unlock the battery. So you unlock that and you sort of unlock it and slide it out. And you have one, two, three, four screws that you need to take out. And all the screws have different icons, but these are the only screws that have the little icon for the memory. So with these four screws, you sort of get a, a Phillips head about that size. Uh, loosen a couple of them. And what I usually do is uh, sort of flip it over and hold my hand over them, and then they'll come out like that. Flip it back, and then get these other two. This one right here is the one that has the most grip, so that'll come out. Let's see how long that is. Yeah, this guy comes out like so. And then, oops, not that one, but this one. Get that last guy. Same sort of thing. Pull it out. Put my hand on it, flip it over. There goes the battery. Bring it back up, flip it open. This whole front panel is going to be loose now. And you see these two little seams. You just sort of wiggle it like this, and it kind of flips forward like the hood of a Corvette or something like that. It flips forward because it's latching underneath. And now when you flip it forward, come over here. There's this one little connection right there, a little white tab. Just grab it by that and sort of wiggle it out, and then the whole thing comes off, that little tab. And then you have the memory chips in there. Um, you should have a 1 gig chip and a 512 chip. So what you're going to do, these two little buttons, uh, remove it. They, they release it, and then you can sort of slide it out. Uh, be careful not to touch the little gold plates. Uh, so if that's a 1 gig, uh, it'll say right there on the uh, chip, like one gigabyte. Hopefully that's in focus. Um, and then you might have to go down and pull out the one from the bottom, if that's the 512 chip. And it is. So we'll pull that out, and then you'll take the two gig that I gave, and it's got little finger tabs. Kind of pull it out like that. And uh, again, being careful not to touch uh, the gold plating. You slide it in kind of at like a 20 degree angle like that, and then it should just push down and snap into place. You don't have to force it. Uh, if you force it, you're doing something wrong. Then I'll put this one back in. So you have a 2 gig and a 1 gig bringing you up to 3 gig. Um, and then you take this guy, and like I said, the hooks are on the bottom. Uh, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take this and kind of put him back in where he was. Kind of fits like that. And then you want to make sure that this, kind of set it down on the floor, and then, or on the table, and then push it forward, but you make sure these hooks uh, grab and then you slide it down and it should lay flat. If it's not laying flat, then these hooks underneath haven't, aren't in the right place. If I close the lid, flip it over, and you should also be able to check to see that this is a nice smooth seam. If it isn't, turn it back over, pull that front panel off a little bit and reseat it. And then you just reverse the process, put the screws back on, um, make them nice and tight but not too tight. And then um, you're going to put the battery back in and boot it up. And you may get a message that says, hey, the system memory has changed. Press F1 to continue. Just press F1 and continue. So that, that's the last one. That's the longest one to, to screw in. And then this thing should snap back into place. This is the little lock. And good to go. Thanks for watching.